Ah, look who's here. Perfect timing. Turns out I've got a mission that's right up your alley. In other words, something dangerous? See? You're perfect for it. Now then, remember the night the Ganglion hit us? Your team took on a pair of Xenos. Real bad apples. A big old lug and one nasty little lady. Dagon and Rees, I think it was. There's no forgetting those two. Yep, that's them. We just got word they've been spotted skulking around Noctua. Could they be planning another attack? That or who knows what. Whatever they're up to, I can tell you, it ain't gonna be good for us. Muscle man not worry his mustache hair is gray. Team Tatsu is on the case. Right, those two are no pushovers. We fought them once and we beat them once. We're the best choice to take this on. We'll leave immediately. Thanks, Colonel. Still smoking. Bad guys campfire. The residual heat signatures confirm it. This fire was active until just recently. It's strange. A campfire doesn't strike me as their style. Heard something. Someone's coming. Everyone, hide! Looks like we're too late. Damn it. Those two could be anywhere. Come on. That guy's the size of a mech. There can't be that many places for him to hide. Whatever. We'd better report to the captain. Soldiers definitely ganglion. Alma, did you hear that? Guys the size of a mech. And they're looking for a pair. But why would Dagon and Reese? I mean, they're ganglion too, right? Maybe they deserted after bitter defeat courtesy of Tatsu. Courtesy of who? Still, it does sound like they're after our targets. Everything we've heard seems to point that way. Maybe we should shake those two down for intel. See what they know. What do you think? All right. We should be able to handle a couple of grunts easily enough. Let's see what we can find out. Attack from range. Follow me. It's no use. Now then, who are you chasing and why? We'll never talk, human scum. I don't think you understand. This isn't a request. <clears throat> Target sighted. All units rally at point four nine. You hear that? Let's move. What should we do about these two? Knock them out and leave them.
not our pair after all. Yeah, but who are they? Humans? What are they doing here? Who cares? Wipe them out! Uh-oh. Looks like we have no choice. You know what I I'm mean. sorry if we frightened you. My name is Elma, and you are? <sighs> are we correct in assuming that the Ganglion are after you? If so, we might be able to help. We come from a planet called Earth, but now we're fighting the Ganglion here on Mira. Really? Pay them no heed, Rock. But Celica! They just beat up those bad guys! It matters not. I shall not be fooled again. Well, either way, it's not safe here. <sighs> Don't flatter us with your hollow kindness. Listen, I understand that it may be hard for you to trust a random pack of strangers. But we really do want to help if we can. I hope you can believe us. Come on, Celica. They seem all right, don't they? Perhaps, but... Tatsu, pleased to make acquaintance of new friend Celica. And you are... a knock-on? Indeed. Friends save Tatsu from nasty Ganglion. Just like they saved us. Yes, so if Tatsu is trusting friends, Celica can too. No pawn's honor. Well... You might say that we're fugitives of a sort. Ones that are running low on hiding places. Our city, New LA, is home to many races besides humans. Both of you would be welcome there. There's no pressure, of course. You can stay or leave as you see fit. Thank you. That is most kind. My name is Celica. And I'm Brock. Nice to meet you. I'm Lynn. Here, these are the coordinates for New LA. Can you get there okay? I believe the two of us can manage, yes. Then we'll see you back home. Take care, you two! How do you like the city so far? It's rather overwhelming, to be honest. But Rock seems quite content, so... We'd like to stay if that's permissible. Of course. And whatever you need, just let us know, okay? Anytime Celica have a problem, Team Tatsu have the solution. You have our gratitude. 